For High Plus News, I'm John Alba. Comedians are thought of as philosophers of our times as they can often see things that the common person may miss. Throughout history, we've seen comedians predict the future through their jokes, and although getting a laugh is their goal, sometimes they can achieve much more than that. Now, back in 2008, comedian Sean Harris, nephew of legendary comedian Robin Harris, would appear on the reality courtroom drama series Christina's Court after having a dispute with his then girlfriend. In the episode, Christina Perez will use her bailiff Renard Spivey, a real life Texas deputy, as an example of what one should be in a relationship. As Spivey at the time was married for over 20 years. You ask him, he's been married for how long? Over 20 something years. Over 20 years. Look at him though, he look mad. <laughs> you don't look happy, brother. You don't look happy. Interestingly enough, nearly a decade after this episode, it appears that Harris may have predicted the bailiff's charge with a simple joke in the courtroom. An edited version of the episode is now circulating online, showing the prediction along with the real outcome. Oh. Like a child in my People own in house. love, they yell at each other all the oh, time. Oh, that's true. Ask him, he's been married for how long? Over 20-something years. Over 20-something Look at him though, he look mad. <laughs> you don't look happy, brother. <laughs> You don't look happy. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> He's very happy. Sherman Chow, a former TV show bailiff and current Harris County deputy charged with his wife's murder, now ordered not to attend her funeral. Renard Spivey appeared before a judge today. He's facing very specific rules for his bond. Spivey was arrested in July 2019 on a murder charge after he was accused of fatally shooting his wife, Patricia Ann Marshall Spivey. Patricia was 52 at the time of her death. According to local news stations in Houston, when police arrived at the scene, Spivey had told police he and his wife were arguing about his alleged steroid use and infidelity when they fought over a gun in the closet. We was arguing and tussling with the gun. We had been arguing all day. Prosecutors would say that the evidence found was inconsistent with Spivey's claims that the shooting was accidental. After the shooting, investigators spoke with Ezra Washington, Patricia's brother, who told them that Renard had called multiple times before the shooting. According to K. Houston 11, Washington said that Spivey told him, she's gonna make me rise up like the Incredible Hulk and it ain't gonna be good. Spivey was taken into jail and was expected to be released days later on a $50,000 bond. According to CNN, prosecutors had originally asked for a $100,000 bail because they said he was a danger to the community and a flight risk. Since this charge, there has been no further official information released regarding Renard Spivey's verdict. The recent resurfacing of this moment has caused many to respond and react to the news, including Law & Order actor and rapper Ice-T. Ice would catch the moment on Twitter and respond with, okay, this is wild as F, crazy. As far as for Sean Harris, he would connect with one of our producers for comment regarding his prediction, and this is what he had to say to us. Very surprised, he was a cool dude, and he always liked and supported my comedy shows, and that episode helped Judge Christina win an Emmy. He would always come to the improv with his wife to see me. Spiley was a bailiff on Christina's court in 2008, and later Justice for All with Judge Christina Perez, where he gained most of his notoriety. What do you guys think about Sean Harris's prediction? Let's talk about him on the comments below. Stay up to date with the latest news and culture by subscribing here to your YouTube channel, and follow us across all social media. For High Plus News, I'm John Abba.